Now, before we get started with the actual commentary, I just gotta say, nice choice of music. The Prowler by Iron Maiden. I myself prefer your Angry Again intro, but I guess that's a matter of opinion. Hey guys, what's up? What's up? This is Helsing920, and it's time for the Fanboy Chronicles. And tonight's Fanboy Chronicles is one that I've been holding off on doing for quite some time. Simply because I know all of the horrible responses I'm going to get for it. That really didn't seem to stop you in your rant on recolors. Care to explain that sudden change of heart? However, since there's a new Final Fantasy game coming out, I thought, what the hell, let's cover them now. Especially since the fanboys have made themselves ridiculously vocal about this upcoming fi Final Fantasy game. Of course they would. They're fanboys. They're gonna whine and bitch and complain about anything that doesn't catch their fancy, as I like to say. But I will get to that in just a sec. First of all, I guess I should attempt to explain for the five of you who have no clue what Final Fantasy is. Why? This video is being made in a time where everyone and their freaking great-grandma knows what Final Fantasy is. Final Fantasy is a video game fran franchise. It's a series of role-playing games created by a company called Square Enix. It used to just be called Square, and before that it was Squaresoft, but that has nothing to do with anything. First of all, the reason why it's called Final Fantasy is because it was going to be the company's last game, because they were about to go bankrupt. And then the game sold like crazy, and now they're up to their 13th, 13th game in the main series. What do you mean the main series? There's no such thing as the main series as far as Final Fantasy goes. But there's about 17 or 18 different fucking spin-off games at least. Spin-off games, sequels, and what have you. Could you please back that up with a short list of spin-off games and sequels, just out of sheer curiosity? Now, this actually leads to one interesting element of the fanboy portion of the Final Fantasy fan base, and that is, very few of them are die-hard devoted to the entire franchise. Most of them seem to love just one game, and that one game will differ from person to person. And why shouldn't it? I mean, every fanboy of everything has to have their, a certain preference as to exactly what they like. Like me, I'm a Super Mario fanboy of ages, but my personal favorite game is New Super Mario Brothers for the Wii. Now, are you going to complain about that? No. Example, a lot of them are fans specifically for Final Fantasy VII, some of them for Final Fantasy IV, some of them for Final Fantasy XII. I don't know why. I actually played XII. I thought it sucked. But there are still people who adore it. There, there are people who love Final Fantasy XI, which is basically just World of, World of Warcraft with a big Final Fantasy sticker slapped on the box. I think you mean EverQuest. Or actually, if we want to talk about, you know, just the general look, it's actually EverQuest with a Final Fantasy sticker on it, but I don't care right now. Let's continue. So, if you happen to find someone who just absolutely adores Final Fantasy VII, let's say, because so many of them seem to adore this game for some strange reason, I've never... Are you out of your mind? People love it because it practically started the popularity of Final Fantasy. It has some of the greatest characters ever. I mean, it's got Cloud Strive, Tifa Log, Heart, Eris, and it's got one of the most badass super villains of all time, Sephiroth. Man, use your head. Never totally figured out. If you tell them that, you think that the game sucks. Which really would never happen. Prepare for a lecture. They will go off on you. I actually did this once. 45 minutes of them, of them borderline screaming at me, talking about how the characters are deep in the story, and the story is fantastic, and you know all this other crap. And when I would mention my biggest problems with it, the fact that, and I never thought I'd say this about, about a game, it feels like it takes too fucking long to finish. Right, right, right. They're, they're, they take too long, and you're not even going to back that up in the least. It has cutscenes that are so goddamn long, and they just bog the story down. You know, and they will go, no, man, no, man, Sephiroth is the fucking answer for everything. He is the main reason for playing the game. 
Some people play games for the heroes. Some people play games for the villains. Is that a problem? Really? So, the villain is the main reason, huh? I'm sorry, I'm going to have to pass, thank you. And you see, folks, that is kind of it. And you, in, and like I said, you can do this with any game in the fucking series. And odds are you will find a fanboy who is going to bitch you out because you don't like their one select game in the series. Now, mind you, folks, uh, this actually is going to be my general thought on Final Fantasy in you know, general. Which, given your little track record on YouTube, is probably going to come back to bite you in the ass eventually. 